Today, we're gonna to be talking about building on the coast. My name is Jana Terrell, and I am the sales manager at the Savannah, Georgia office of America's Home Place. Being on the coastal area, it's a lot of fun. We have builds in Hilton Head and coastal properties that are really beautiful. And also here in Savannah, we've got several beautiful, beautiful coastal lots. One of the biggest challenges that we face are elevations. The customer may not expect to have to have a home elevated. The survey kind of dictates what to expect. So in many cases, we have several options. We can do an elevated mono slab. We can do a stem wall out of concrete block. And we can also do a pier house, which is our Amelia. It's a beautiful two-story, three-bedroom, two-bath home that is very coastal. Only one plan in our selections is a peer home, but we can modify any of our plans to accommodate a peer style house. So being on the coast, there's a lot of different wind zone requirements and restrictions. Wind zones do add expense, but we try to make sure that we're as transparent up front as possible to not have any unforeseen surprises. You might have divots in the ground that require extra dirt that we had not accommodated for. So in cases like that, we just keep the customer very much up to date as to what to expect so that we can make modifications, take some things out to negate the costs of items that we weren't aware of. Style-wise, the tabby finish has been really popular here lately. It is oyster shell and concrete mixed together and it creates just a really interesting, unique feature to the home. If you want to learn anything more, contact us at americashomeplace.com. Please like the video and comment below.